what is going on guys welcome back to the channel critical overlord here so production has started on the sequel to last year's very successful sci-fi thriller a quiet place directed and written by john krasinski who many of you know from the office uh i do as well it starred him emily blunt uh noah jupe i think that's his name and millicent brown uh millicent simmons brown or millicent brown simmons one of those but anyway the production on the second film began earlier this week uh john krasinski sent out a tweet saying the production has started the film to my knowledge was set to come out in may of next year but now it's been pushed up a few months earlier it's actually coming out in march next year which would be a month earlier than when the original came out if i'm not mistaken in the film they've told us or john krasinski at first he wasn't even going to come back to write or direct this from what i recall i think that's what was said from him him specifically uh, and while he is writing and directing it for those who have seen the movie he is not starring in it and then also for those who are asking how is he writing and directing it if he's not in the movie do not ask stuff like that go make yourself knowledgeable on the process of filmmaking uh anyway the movie itself i think it's going to dwell into a bit about the origins of the creatures. We may get some info in regards to where they came from, what happened those 90 or 80 something days before the first film. We may get a backstory as to why or how, more specifically what led to the military not being able to come up with something, how come no one else came up with something regarding these things. Uh, we're, there, there are gonna be a ton of new cast members. No, nothing has been announced outside of one specific person or two, two specific people that, that I was made aware of and because it came out in the news. Uh, I know Brian Tyree Henry who starred in this year's Child's Play remake. He's one of the new cast members. Emily Blunt and the kids are back. Uh, I believe Emily Blunt will be our focal character. She'll be taking the lead this time around. Uh, not that she wasn't like a lead in the last movie, but like she, she more than likely will get more screen time and more attention will be put on her character. Uh, than anything so she might be the character that's looking to carry the narrative with the kids and the newcomers what do i think will happen in the movie i'm not really too sure i think we may see them hook up with another survival group that would be something i would like to see uh how exactly this will lead to the monsters or the creatures aliens whatever you want to call them how exactly this will lead to them getting attacked by those creatures again I'm assuming it would have something to do with the fact that maybe they have been out there living on their own. The creatures start, the creatures chase them. Uh, maybe they run into some type of safe haven and they find that it's inhabited by other people who've been surviving out here in the safe haven. I don't know. There's a whole entire universe to explore here with a lot of explaining to do as well. Because while the first film was well made and it was well shot, uh, well acted, well directed, the only really issue that it had was its writing and I that's really just a risk you take when you write movies like this the logistics of everything have to essentially get thrown out of the window to make the story believable but some of the things in a quiet place I think were a bit too over the top I still give the film a 7 out of 10 but some of the logistics they were still a bit like okay, okay do we really have to do that there's nothing that we have nothing else that we could have done that would have been more logical here uh, so hopefully we get a backstory on the creatures. Uh, we've been told that's what we would be getting, but you know, things could always change. Hopefully we, we get to find out where they came from. I don't think this is going to be the last movie in the series. I think that they're going to make this a nice trilogy. A Quiet Place 3 could be the final thing, or this could turn into a whole shebang like The Purge, like The Conjuring Universe, everything that we get coming out every other year or two. I don't want that to happen here. I would like a nice trilogy. If they stop with this movie, I'm fine with that as well. As long as we can just, if you're making a, a movie that's getting good critical reception, is making a lot of money, you can make as many as you want to, I guess. But for my thing, I don't see the I don't see a Quiet Place lasting beyond three movies, let alone two movies. Uh, I'm glad the film's in production. Expect more news to come out though in regards to the cast and the filming process and set picks should come out soon and we should find out a whole lot more details in regards to the plot. Uh, but let me know what you guys think about that down in the comment section below. If you haven't already, subscribe and turn on post notifications so you never miss a video. In the description, I have links to all my social media accounts. I'm on Facebook, Twitter, and Instagram. You can message me there to let me know what movies, news, or reviews you would like me to cover in the future. With all that in mind, guys, I will see you in the next video.